All right, now the metadata menu actually has five items that are worth mentioning. Uh, one is this copy paste metadata. Now we, we're going to talk about a lot of different ways to actually synchronize and add metadata and change metadata, but another really a useful way to do that is just to basically copy and paste it just like you would any file. And there's also a shortcut which is kind of ridiculously long, but it's Control Shift Alt plus C and then Control Shift Alt plus V. And so we can take metadata that's applied from one image and just easily copy it to the next. Now synchronizing is another way, and then you also have auto synchronization, which is another way as well. And we'll go over all that when we get to metadata. But that is uh, just to bring that up, those are available also from this metadata menu. Now the next item is this edit capture time. Now if you ever have time stamp issues, basically if you're shooting with multiple cameras and they're not correctly synchronized uh, as far as the date and time stamp, then you can edit them here and actually correct that. Now we have a specific tutorial on that, so simply do a search on SR Lounge or look in the Lightroom Guide and we'll teach you exactly how to fix timestamp sync issues. But that is uh, found right here in the metadata menu as well. The next item is this save metadata to file and read metadata from file. The, the save is actually going to save those two XMPs. The read is actually going to read them from the XMPs. So if there's updates or changes, you can actually save them or read them from those XMP files. And the next useful item is this purge unused keywords. We're going to talk about importing and exporting keywords uh, sets later on. But this purge unused keywords is actually really nice because what it'll do is any keywords that are in your keyword list here or you know that show up anywhere basically on this keywording that are actually unused, when you click purge it's going to just going to remove them all. So it's a quick and easy way to get rid of everything. So check out birds, that is a completely unused. So when I click this it's going to automatically remove it from my list right here. It's a nice way of removing these keywords without having to right click and hit delete on each one of those that you aren't using. Alright, that's everything inside the metadata menu, so let's move on to the view menu.